Damn. You one ugly looking fish. You the damn most ugliest fish I'd ever laid eyes on. Damn, you one ugly fish. <laughs> Excuse me. Anyways, hey everybody, this is the Gaming Dragon, and welcome back to Psychonauts! Hooray! Last time! A lot of stuff happened last time. We fought a tank that had Dogen's brain in it, and then we beat the crap out of this thing. I was very stupid that episode. I kept not figuring out how to fight the bosses. Like, I don't know what was with me. Like, I, like going back to the footage, I was like, I'm never this stupid. Like, for whatever reason, I was just- I was so stupid. I don't know where my brain was. How ironic with the theming of this game, that I didn't know where my brain was. <laughs> but, uh, anyways. Now that, um, we are finally back again, it is time to jump in head- I didn't realize that, that the camera made water sounds when you dipped it beyond the water. Also, freaky hands. Anyways, we're gonna jump into Fishboy's brain. Poor little thing. And, uh, deal with that. How do I do that? I think I have to grab the door. <laughs> I forgot we had bacon. I think we have to grab the door and then use it on, on the fish. Yeah, there we go. All right, here we go. Into Fish Boy's brain. Oh, that looks weird. Oh my god. Do not. Top of the morning to you, ma'am. And good day to you, Officer of Lungfish. How are you today? Oh, damp and happy, can't complain. And what are you and the wee one up to on this lovely day? Oh, just obeying the law as always. All posted directives followed to the letter. Ah, good to hear. Not a one of us want any trouble, that's for sure. Ah! Ah! Oh, Gagala! Okay. <laughs> okay. I I did not expect I did not expect this. This is great. Wait, are the hands still going to get me in the water? This water can't kill me. I am a god. Oh wait. Okay. I'm not going to lie. I thought I was legitimately going to have to like can I destroy this? No, but I can climb it! <laughs> I thought I was legitimately going to have to explore this entire city. Thank you. I thought I was going to have to explore this entire city and I was like, Oh my god, this place is so big. But of course, they had to pull a fast one on me like that. That was great. Hey, and Gogalore. Down here! Excuse me. Are you talking to me? Ah, oh, my ears. I'm sorry. Ah, oh my god. Ah. Are you okay? He's dead. Oh jeez, I'm sorry. Don't worry. Every member of the resistance is prepared to die fighting the tyranny of Kochamara. What's Kochamara? He's a giant monster like you, Gogalore. He brainwashed and enslaved almost everyone in Lungfishopolis. That stinks. So hey. Have you seen any other humans around here? I'm looking for a girl called Lily. The government archives might have some information about your young girlfriend, Gogalore. Yeah, I don't know if she's really my girlfriend. I mean, I think she... I only meant that she is your friend who was a girl, Gogalore. 
To access the archives, we must first destroy the broadcast tower Kochamara uses to control the populace. Check. I'll go smash that then. Wait, Kagalor! In order to reach the tower, you'll need to pass through that wall of lasers. But you'll never make it through the lasers without our help. So are you gonna start helping soon? First, I need you to do something for the Resistance. Punch a hole in that prison and free my comrades! Okay, this Freedom. Freedom. just got better. Yeah. Now, how about getting me past those gates? Right. We stole the shield power module from Coach Amara. It's too big for any of us to operate, but it should work for you. A badge. Kochamra and all your little brainwashed neighbors? No! I doubt it. Uh, no, no. So, knocking down the prison and then breaking this laser shield thing? Nobody's gonna get mad about that and start shooting at me. No! I don't... Uh, maybe one guy would. But what is even an entire navy of lungfish against the might and revolutionary zeal of Gagalore? Wait. What navy? Meet us at the dam, Gagalore. For freedom! Uh, psychic shield to protect you from damage and reflect some enemy attacks back at the attacker. Ooh. No, you will not be able to maintain a psychic shield forever, and when this part of your mind is exhausted, you will need to wait a while before using it again. Okay. <laughs> oh my god! The orphanage! <laughs> this is great! I didn't honestly think they were gonna put in, like... I didn't... The peaceful city of Lungfishopolis is under attack tonight by a hideous, gigantic monster the terrified citizens have named Gogalore. The Navy has responded quickly and decisively, dispatching its entire tank division to neutralize the creature. Soon, authorities say, everything will return to normal or better. Kidnapping human children is good. This guy needs a double bag tag. Okay, you know what? Screw these lungfish. Like, <laughs> they're like, oh no, we're not gonna attack you. Just one guy might. And then the whole freaking navy comes at me. Okay, but seriously, in all seriousness, I'm actually absolutely ecstatic that, like, That they made a Godzilla reference in this. Like, that's great. But the thing is, what these guys don't know is I'm a master at Godzilla Destroy All Monsters on the GameCube. They have no idea what they're getting themselves into. I played that game from from this way to Sunday. I know it's in and out. <laughs> I think they can shoot at me. I've destroyed more more members of the navy than they even know. And yet surprisingly the water does not kill me. But I'm going to grab these figments. There are a lot of figments just kind of hiding around. Should I destroy the trees? I'm not gonna waste my time trying to destroy the trees. <laughs> that's- that's- I'm surprised that's even a question that I'm saying out loud. Should I destroy the trees? I can just- oh. They're giving me too many options. They're allowing me to be able to pick up the tanks. This is gonna- this is like the best option for me to like to be able to grab as many figments and level up and get some uh... Get some moolah as well. I need to find the tag for that thing too. And I still never got the frickin... Whatchamacallit. Uh, the duster. The cobweb duster. I never got that. Don't shoot at me. 
And I'm trying to do something on my phone real quick because I'm stupid. How- excuse me, I can hear you shooting at me and I don't appreciate it, good sir. Oh, here we go again. Well, things have gotten a little embarrassing for Gagalore. Recently surfaced information has strongly linked the previously intimidating monster with common lowlife criminals. Earlier tonight, Gagalore broke some of his jailhouse cronies out of the slammer so they could enjoy a night on the town, popping pills and soliciting inexpensive car girls. Well, they're in for one nasty hangover. Our beloved Navy has come up with a high-tech new invention. Trucks armed with hyper-electricity. Kidnapping children do not harm the brains. Are y'all implying... Okay, that actually did damage. Are y'all implying that this place has got some lungfish that are making some very interesting phone calls? Okay, uh, actually, let me equip that, uh, that shield. Right, there we go. Ow. You jerks. I mean watery the hell. I hate the water. Hit me. You don't need cheese, you're a fish. Actually, I say that like fish don't eat cheese, but I know for a fact they do because I've seen catfish eat cheese before, so. Ow. Unrealistic. Tanks do not hurt that much when you're this big. I mean, theoretically speaking. If you're talking about somebody actually being that big, tank would not do that much damage. Oh my god, really? Again? The destruction and terror continue as the hulking, godless child beast carves a bloody swath through our helpless city. Our noble, all-volunteer navy has been surprised only by the senseless lust for mayhem that seeps from the twisted black lump of a heart in this creature, still known only as Guggle. Though it uh -huh. loathes violence in all its forms, the navy has no choice but to activate its anti-monster turrets, which it guarantees are 100% monster-proof, not be caught stealing children. Okay, you know what? Oh, I didn't realize how much damage that was doing. Right, and also- you, How about you shut up, woman? You guys kidnap Lily. And you're also just figments of the mind. Okay. That thing activates- w goes off way faster than I think it is. Do you think I can shoot it? Why doesn't the Navy electrocute him? Okay, yeah, there we go. Gogalor, what are you doing down here? I'm trying to get to that Kochamra Tower thing so I can smash it. The laser tunnel, Gogalor. We have to get through that or we'll never get to Kochamra Island. But I thought... There is no I in T, Gogalor. Yeah, but there's an I in Squish, so watch it. I'll go take out your laser tunnel, but then we're gonna talk about who's running this revolution. Okay, hey, I'm trying to look around. You ain't gotta be rude. Uh, oh, there's a blimp up there. Can I even get up there? This- this music is amazing, by the way. Can I even get up there? It doesn't look like it. I don't think that's gonna work. 
Okay, so you can't- you can't jump like that. Okay, so you can't use your- okay. I pressed levitation way too many times. Levitation isn't gonna work. Alright. This really is just a ripoff of Godzilla music, we like- faced monsters like you before, Gogalore, No, you haven't. Smaller. <laughs> I was gonna say, no you haven't. You're a bunch of lungfish. Shut up. I love the fact that they just gave you basically a portable shield. I forgot to press the button. Let's try that again. That destroyed the whole damn thing. Oh, okay. Hey, first and foremost, I need this. And then I'm going to travel all the way back and free that, uh, and get that bag that I missed back here. Okay, there we go. Tag is back. And now I'm going all the way back. <laughs> Alrighty. Now back to destroying shit. Because that's what I do best and that's what I like to do. Oh my god, look at the teeny tiny little memory vault! Come back! That was fast. Lungfish... Lungfish Opolis under siege. <laughs> Uh, yes, of course. Uh huh. Well, that's a lot of exclamation marks right there. In a second, though. I'm destroying everything else. Ah, there's the purse. So I remember picking up the purse tag, I just didn't, like... ...know where the purse was, but now I do. Hello, purse. Here you go. Have your tag back. I- I still don't like the- the bag, the emotional baggage. And I still can't believe I'm saying that out loud. Emotional baggage. Freedom! 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 <laughs> Freedom! So, this big monster, is that the best you could do? We were short on time, and he is good at smashing things. Doesn't look like much to me. Come on, let's blow this joint. Hey, you're welcome. Sorry about him, Gargalore. He's been in prison a long time. He's the only pilot the Resistance has, and he has an excellent plan. Meet us at the dam so we can put it into action. Going all the way back to the dam! Now you see the genius of our plan, Gargalore. First we print flyers, then we spread them all over town with my blimp. Winning over the hearts and minds of Lungfishopolis in as soon as six months. Six months? You don't like our plan, you can come up with another one. Yes, we are busy. We have to select cardstock and then find a decent but inexpensive printer within the week. How about jumping on top of the blimp and having it- Uh, can I get- get off? I would like- Knock it off! Never! I'm surprised this doesn't break. How- how does this not break? Okay, get- 
Okay, there we go. Got another tag, which means there's more emotional baggage around here somewhere. And there, oh, it's literally right there. I was walking over here for the figments and for that thing, the whatever. Take your tag. I hate you the most, I think. I thought I hated the purse the most, but honestly, I think I hate these ones the most. I just don't like how big and wide their mouths are. And they're, God, I, I'd say that just about them, but in general, it's literally all of them. Their eyes are just so, their eyes are so freaky. Da 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 da. Ba, 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 ba. I can't help myself. Like it's like it's has this it's uses the same exact tune as the main Godzilla theme. I can't help myself. I hear it and that's all I can think of. And I think that's what they were going for, and they are genius for that. I can go talk to Ford again for uh, Oh, okay, that's actually deep water. All right, I see. I'm gonna go talk to Ford to get a new Psy power, but I have to actually, like... <laughs> Did that tree just make a very small and simple snap sound? Look, guys, y'all are not doing your best if you're trying to shoot me. Y'all are doing your worst. Just saying. And then I immediately get shot. You know what? Screw you guys. Ammo up! Thank you. Okay, tanks, you know what? Okay, I thought I could jump over that, but I failed. Raz, I know you can jump higher than that. Just because just because you're acting the role of being a lot bigger than you actually are doesn't mean you have to act like you're that big. Because I know you're not. So stop it. Who am I kidding? I can't blame the kid for trying to get into the role of things. Can I not hit you? Okay. Um, did I get everything on here? Okay, that bridge. That's a bridge. So I'm pretty sure I have to head that way. So You know, I do find it a little annoying that Ford, like, is constantly on the screen when you have a new ability. I mean, I guess it's the learn. I guess it's there so that we, like, don't forget. Mm. But, like, it is kind of annoying. Big and in the way. Not in the way, but it is big. Okay, water. I'm trying to grab the figment if you don't mind. How about you leave me alone? How many of these buildings are there? There's so many. Wee. There's 
a cobweb over there. And some buildings I didn't smash. I'm sorry, I played Godzilla Destroy All Monsters. Uh, to destroy everything. I spent as much time as I possibly could destroying as much- is causing as much destruction as I possibly could. It's in my nature. I cannot help myself. You cannot, and I repeat, you cannot give me the option to destroy an entire city and then expect me to not take the opportunity. I don't care who you are. Ten-year-old boy with psychic powers or otherwise. I am going to destroy as much shit as I possibly can, and you cannot convince me or tell me otherwise. You will fail. Very slowly... rail grind. Okay, I was trying to actually, like, not destroy the... stuff, but, like... I'm doing a very bad job at not destroying- oh god, and not destroying the tanks. Tanks. The trains. Ah, oh, here we go again. We're here with the star of the popular sitcom Trouble in the Bubble, Buddy Finn. Buddy, what's your take on the Gogalore situation? Is he just misunderstood? Yes. No way! I hate Gogalore! I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He hates everything lungfish care about. Air, water, family, the economy. Buddy, you'll be happy to know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. <laughs> Airplanes! <laughs> so rest assured, we can all look forward to Gogalore's imminent death. And to seeing you, buddy, every Thursday night at 8, right here on LVC. Thanks! And I'd just like to add that if anyone kidnaps a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. Gogolor, come in. We have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Kochamara Channel, to get to Kochamara Island, and destroy Kochamara Tower! The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will soon contain the area, Gogolor, we... uh... uh we just think it best to do where... Uh, We've decided to maintain our position out here. Just until you clear the area of all hostiles. Yes. For insurance reasons, Gogolor. Yes, that, and for freedom. I'm sure. I'm... Okay, well, you guys just ran into me. That's not my fault. Why are these buildings so big? Eh. Oh my god, why is it so big? <laughs> ah! Let me- okay, never mind. I didn't think second time around it was just gonna pull me in. Give me that. This is just me going around destroying everything the episode. Lungfish and Lobato. Who in the ha now? That's a lungfish. That's a lungfish. That is the guy from the thing that did the thing to Dogen. And that's Commander or Captain Oleander or whoever. Oleander somebody. Mori, I think, is what they called him. It made him a giant lungfish. And then they cheered heroically with pictures. All right. Let me up. Uh, do I have your tag? 
Yes, I do. Good. Good, 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 Cause some more mayhem, cause more mayhem. Did I climb this one or did I climb the other one? That's a question that I don't think you'd probably hear me say a whole lot. Of course you have to tightrope on the bridge. I just realized the amazing irony of the fact that, uh, like, it's like, like, you have this- this ten-year-old who's- well, A, he's psychic, but like, you have this kid who's incredibly, like, acrobatic, and like, their reasoning for saying why he's so acrobatic is, oh, he used- he used to work at the circus. Oh, the thing is out. But yeah, like I was saying, like their their solution is saying, oh, he ran away from the circus. That's why he's so acrobatic. He was worked at the circus. And it's like, oh, okay, that makes sense, I guess. <laughs> I just think that's funny. I don't know why, like all this stuff, like before I started recording, like it all just kind of like popped into my head while I was thinking, nice jump raz. Like, it just kind of popped into my head and I was like, huh, ain't that ironic that that's how they decided to, like, solve their problem was just say he was he was a circus runaway -y. Which, in the end, isn't that the irony of it all, considering it's people who mostly run to the circus, not run away from it. You... You mother... Excuse me? No, get on- Okay, get off the building. I mean, not get off the building, get off the- the grind rail. And get on the building, that's what I want you to do. Can I not move to the left? I guess not. Oh my god, there's so many figments. I would just like to climb down. I would just like to climb down and grab the figments. And also, I can't, every single time that ba 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 pops up, I cannot not hear Godzilla music. Hey buddy, I got your tag. I'm slowly coming up here to get you. Here's your tag, my man. Enjoy it. Whoop! Okay, where is... Oh my god, there's so much mental health around here. Um, let's see, here's another. Grab that. I'm just getting all the level ups out of this. Because I'm like, picking up so many figments because this place is so big. Like, not big, but like, it's condensed. Oh jeez! I did not want to fall. How am I gonna get those helicopter ones that are like over the water? That's what I wanna know. You know, pass by, don't worry. Can I like. I can. Aha! Oh, that's the tower. I never even saw that thing. Did I? 
I feel like I should have seen it, but like I, pr I don't just don't think I did. But I feel like I should have. All right, destroying more buildings. Okay, I can see how I can get those. Oh my god, there's a figment back there I missed, and I can't help myself but go back and get it. Um. I'm over the length of this video, but I have to grab this figure. Okay. The water! I'm over the length of this video. Still proceeds across the water to go and destroy the tower. Alright, you know what? Since there's like nothing shooting me here on this boat. I'm gonna stop right here and next time on Psychonauts we're going to destroy the tower, free the lungfish, and save Lily, which I assume isn't here anymore because they said something about an asylum. So I'm assuming she's not here and the lungfish probably took her to whatever this asylum is and that's where we're gonna have to go next, so that's that's my assumption. Anyways, I'll see you guys then.